Oh, I love that food court. Yeah. It's always good to see Union Station burning light. Oh, yeah. Hey folks, Jerome Forestwood here. It's 3.52 p.m. on November 30th, 2021 in downtown Toronto, Ontario, Canada. It's 3 degrees outside with a wind chill of minus 1 on an overcast afternoon in the city. In this video, my partner and I walk for 2.2 kilometers starting at the new food court in the lower level of the Bay Concourse at Union Station. Then stroll west along the city's indoor path network through St. Andrew Station to Metro Centre Hall, exiting the path at 225 King Street West. We then wander west along King Street, north on Spadina and west along Queen, ending our trek at Value Bets to pick up an order. At the time of this recording, the COVID-19 pandemic was persisting, so masks and proof of vaccination were required in some settings. If you enjoy this content, follow me for updates on Instagram at jforestwood. And if you enjoy this video, please smash that like button, share it, and subscribe. So where do you want to go? Okay, we are getting some icky, sticky devil's lettuce from Buddy <laughs> Butts turn Queen Street West. Love it. So, let's go. Okay. Given how cold this whole area is, we're trying to stay as much indoor as humanly possible. <laughs> sure. Given this is Toronto, <laughs> downtown Toronto, the opportunities are actually better than anywhere else. <laughs> Do you want to walk through the path network today? Okay. Those are some new graphics. We're in your first Canadian. Oh no, that's first. We're in first Canadian place. No, mm -hmm. we're heading towards first Canadian. Place. Oh, okay. We're at the uh, Royal Bank Plaza. Royal Bank Plaza. Okay, cool. towards Toronto Dominion Center before we go west. Oh, okay. Pretty much under King Street or close to King Street. And we're going to pop out there around uh, that David uh, Peacon Park? Mm, not sure. We'll okay, see. we'll find out. Go with the flow. Let's see what has life has and hope for us. Hey, I dressed up for the cold. You're the one here. Wanted to walk inside. Yeah, I don't know if you do. <laughs> but at the same time, let's try to make our own lives as much as possible. Sure. Especially given how wet the streets are, sidewalks are, I don't know if I'm going to do a puddle or get splashed by a passing car. Okay. Of course, if somebody is into getting splashed by cars or into puddles, that's their choice. I respect that completely. Yeah, I usually just step, uh, stand a few steps back from the curb instead of directly on the curb. Sure. <laughs> Whatever works. <laughs> David, bougie up the path. No, I believe it's the same as last year. But of course, the lights do make this depressing time feel better. Uh, I don't remember these ones over here on the side. They had something last year too, but I don't know if it was the same. Mm, <laughs> Clearly I wasn't paying much attention to Christmas decorations in the Path Network last year. No. <laughs> Given the Path Network itself was so closed up. 
Oh yeah. Sometimes you couldn't even get through during main hours because of the pandemic. They just shut the whole thing down. Parts of it were closed up. Well, sections, yeah. So it's kind of fun to be able to walk through this. Now we're heading west towards St. Andrew Station. Are we going to the marketplace? Yeah, things have changed so much. Cool. I can hardly recognize this place. Yeah, you're the one who's supposed to know this better than me. He worked down here. That's <laughs> why I'm so surprised, huh? Yeah, this is your environment. Oh my gosh, this is so depressing. This place was full of life. Oh. It feels so dead. Believe it or not, this is more people than usual. Oh yeah, that is the set. <laughs> Yeah, you know what John Tory said today? At least it was reported in the news that he said that on January 1st or some kind of day like that, so everyone in City Hall is coming back to the office. Or at least will be invited to come back to the office. So, hmm. I think that's kind of interesting. Yeah, sure, whatever. Do you think people are really going to go back to the office? I don't know. I mean, if it were me, I would want some sense of normalcy back to the state school. Clearly, that's not the case. Mm -hmm. Put the tables out again. Is they put those chairs away before. IDs here as well. Yeah. I haven't seen any of these reopen. <sighs> Except for that one, the comfort. I saw that one all reopen. I think it was just closing early. You can hear music coming out of it. That's heartbreaking. In a while. We're actually walking from King, uh, I'm sorry, St. Andrews, King West, uh, subway station towards Roy Thompson Hall. Oh. oh my gosh, this place looks so dead. <laughs> I would say this there'd is, probably be a lot, like this is 100 times the amount of people on here that there are not. Mm -hmm. This is literally after work rush. Uh, oh yeah, this would be like, you know. And huh. just looking at the difference, it's just, oh wow. It really would be really packed, you'd just be able to walk out here oh, and yeah. you'd have to like dodge people. That's what I did. There yeah. would be too many people.
Okay. Can't remember everything. It's, uh, it used to be pretty interesting, this place would have all sorts of winter festivities and concerts going on well into December, so it is quite upsetting how dead this <laughs> place is. The same point in time, but let's look at the positive side. It can only go up from here, you know? Or at least fingers so. crossed. Fingers crossed and knocking on wood. Oh, Metro Center. Forgetting it exists. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's fine. I'm gonna come back and do that again. Of course you will. I always. Oh yeah, of course I will. <laughs> that's so cool. I did come down here once. But only once when I was filming. I think that was last. In the winter time or something like that, so. Just exit through here, yeah. These are my old stomping grounds. And this is literally your old stuff here. Yeah, we can use this for right here. This one will slide open. <laughs> I bet you haven't been there for a while because I definitely remember bringing you up here through that exact route back in I guess 2019 yeah I don't remember that <laughs> but then again I just knew you were walking me through the path I didn't know where I was going path network is pretty easy mm -hmm. if you know which direction is north south, east and west if the directions are right, you can actually navigate pretty easily. Like, I can find myself efficiently from Union Station or even the South Car all the way up to um, the Eden Center. But still, to go through the Metro Hall, uh, yeah. that's still a little bit of a challenge for me. I still got to memorize that. I could have done that, that today. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. I, I didn't know. Well, we were over in that same area. end up at this vagina if you want. Yeah, that sounds good. I'm down with Spadina. Yeah, we were actually here a few weeks ago when we decided to visit Miss Jones's... Uh, what's the place in there? I actually forgot. I just call it Miss Jones. It's just the easiest to remember that. Miss Jones! They had that one particular cartridge that I really, really, really wanted. Watermelon Skittles uh -huh. from Tenzo. Oh boy, and they deliver. They 
King West Kitchen. Sure, like you try so many different places. Actually, I haven't tried any of the restaurants on that street. <laughs> yeah. Well, let me second call you out. <laughs> Sorry, home cooking is pretty good. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Yeesh, this is why I was walking in here. Look how messy this place is. I'm so sorry. Yeah, they're a little damp. We did have a lot of snow melt off today. Oh, yeah. It actually snowed quite a bit today as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it kind of melted and then it came back and then now that's melting. Ugh. As if like nature or something, right? I know, nature. Wow, why can't we just call her up and schedule this stuff? Yeah, I don't think you can <laughs> schedule nature like Zoom meetings and shit. <laughs> no, I don't think so either. So this Kitchen Plus over here um, has moved, eh? I didn't know that. Yeah. Just thought I'd save you time in case you're running over here for something. Thank you for saving my... Well, you were going to see the signs in a few minutes, so... Sure. You realize we live in the exact same city. You can't just pretend to know more things. I'm not pretending to know more things. Sure. Him, yeah? sure. Hey, you just navigated us through the path. Oh, that was intense. I think that's part of construction, not somebody vandalizing something. Oh yeah, it's still intense. Look at all the sparks and everything. Because he was using a cutter. Of course. How do these streetcars go all the way up to St. Pierre? How you definitely want to know. Which street is the connecting line between these two? Bathurst maybe? That's got to be King because it says Via King. Mm. No, it can't be King though. It's King no, goes this it, way. Does Bathurst go all the way up to St. Clair? Mm. Yeah, Bathurst probably extends all the way to St. Clair. Interesting. I'm going to take a look next time I'm filming up there just to see where the tracks go. Because I can't remember right now. I just posted a video though, not too long ago. I could check that one too. I walked up to the Davenport, Davenport Road, and then over and through um, Regal Heights. Yeah. Look back at that, see if the tracks extend. It'll also give you to check out a video of your favorite uh, Toronto walker. You, yourself. <laughs> I bet you'd love all of that. <laughs> well, I do create the contents I enjoy consuming. Sure. That is correct. <laughs> That's actually something common between both of us. We both love you. 
Aww. Oh, it's the vagina. Enhancing cafe. Are these the people who use shrooms on their cafe? Yeah, they got a sign right there. Ah! Yeah, Mood yeah. enhancing. Shroom boost. Yeah. Mood enhancing drink. Ooh. So you were there for a few minutes. That's interesting. Is this like the CBD version of shrooms? <laughs> Probably. I always like this part of Spadina. I love Spadina through and through. Even when it turns into Spadina Road, I still love it. Mm. Also, everything downtown other than University, which is right next to Spadina, every single road, even the main ones, feel so narrow and concise. Spadina is huge. If the streetcar tracks weren't here, it would be a six lane road. So Where does it end? Where does Spadina Road end? Like I St. Don't Claire? Know. I thought you should know that. Right? I should know that. I'm gonna look that up. I'm gonna walk out here you for a few minutes while we cross the road. <laughs> I just taking it easy today. Now we're gonna be very careful because there are crazy ass drivers on the street. Ah, oh, she hasn't changed much. Yeah. yeah, it's not the weather to go inside that place. Nah, no, it gets kind of uh, muddy in there. Scaffolding's out. They're done with this part. That's interesting. Yeah, they've moved further down now. Yeah, at least this part isn't so tough. Yeah, so at least they're moving fairly quickly, which is good. Because then we'll be able to have the Spadina streetcar back, hopefully, in the future. No, I understand why they had buses. I always miss out the ants of Cameron House. Look at the ants. 
Oh yeah. It's definitely fun. That's the cutest thing ever. Everything's better in pink. Trust. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'm wearing a pink sweater right now. No, I'm wearing my uh, tan colored sweater with the stripes. See, this the is Egyptian why I weave. walk with yeah. you. Otherwise, you've just gone with that bullshit without even realizing you just bullshitted yourself. Wearing pink shirt. Well, sometimes you know how you say, hey, I think I'm wearing this, and then once you say that, you realize that you're wearing something else? That's just what happened. It was just like, no, I'm not. I'm wearing this. Okay. Devil's lettuce, weather, wait, yes. So, yeah. Bye bye, folks. See you all some other day. Hopefully. I don't know if I'm still like it. <laughs> bye.